Hello student. Students, today we have to start with a new chapter, sound. Students, do you know what is the importance of sound in our life? St sound will be helpful for us to communicate with each other. We hear different kinds of sounds such as blowing of a whistle, chipping of a bird, even a alarm clock sound. Our day starts most of the time with the alarm clock sound. Also, sound helps to us to communicate with each other. We are talking with each other, uh, send the messages to each other through the talking only. Even other animals also communicate through different sounds. They are not able to talk, but they can create different sounds and communicate with each other. Now, there is one question comes in mind. How this sound is produced? As we are able to hear variety of sounds, but how is it produced? Sound is produced because of a vibrating body. Vibration is a rapid to and fro movement. It can help an up and down or a side to side movement. Now there are variety of sources of sound present in the nature. For example, sound is produced by different objects like birds, animals, human beings, musical instruments, tuning folk, vehicles, television, helicopters, etc. Now, do you know why we like the music? Because all the musical instruments create the melodious sounds and it makes us happy. Music is a vital role playing in our life. Today, we have to learn that why every musical instrument has the different sound and how it creates. As we know that sound is created by vibrations, the different musical instruments are creating the different vibrations. And because of that, they are identified as the different types. The first type of musical instrument is wind instrument. We all sing the fluet. Now, if you can observe the fluet, it is made by a hollow pipe. So all the wind instruments like fluet, whistle, shenai, trumpet, etc. are made by a hollow pipe. When air is blown into them, they produce sound by the vibration of the air column. So here are some wind instruments you are able to see on the screen. Next one type is string instrument. In string instruments, music is produced by vibrating a string. If you observe the structure of guitar, veena, sitar, tanpura, sarangi, those all are known as string instruments. The wire strings are fixed up on those instruments an artist has to pluck up those strings only in particular order and a melodious sound is created. So they all are nothing but the string instruments. The next type is called as reed instrument. Reed instrument contains metal reeds that produce sound when air is blown through them. Examples are harmonium and mouth organ where the metal reed is fixed up and air is blown through them creates the melodious sound. The next type is percussion instruments. Now, if you can observe the tabla, dola, drum, on those instruments, a membrane will be fixed up. Especially that membrane is made by an animal skin. These instruments having vibrating skin, so they are called as percussion instruments. The artist has to tap on a membrane and it creates, it vibrates and produces a musical sound. So those are the examples of percussion instruments. The next type is Ghana Vadya. Ghana Vadya are solid instruments commonly known as ideophones also. Sound creates simply beaten or struck to produce a musical sound. Few examples are Manjira, Ghatam and Jaltaram. The Manjira we are specially used for while we are playing a bhajan. Jaltarang, it is the, such an instrument, beautiful instrument in which glass bowls are used and those bowls are filled up with the water but level of water is changing each bowl. If we stuck up those edges of the bowls with the uh, sticks, it will be created a melodious sound because of the vibrations created in itself in the water. That's why it is known as Jaltarang. And the last one picture is of Ghatams. That lady is sitting with the multiple number of earthen pots. And by striking on that, the different voice, uh, sounds will be created. 
सच गाना वैद्य गाना वाद्य आर फेमस इन कर्नाटकी म्यूजिक ना वी हैव टू कम टू द बेसिक पॉइंट दैट हाउ द साउंड इज क्रिएटेड बाय ह्यूमन बींग्स बिकॉज वी ऑल आर कम्युनिकेट विथ इच अदर बाय टॉकिंग ओनली इवन आई एम डिलीवरिंग नाउ द स्पीच इट इज बिकॉज ऑफ दैट टॉकिंग सो वी हैव द वोकल कॉर्ड्स इन अवर थ्रोट दोज वोकल कॉर्ड्स प्ले अ वाइटल रोल फॉर क्रिएटिंग अ साउंड इफ दोज वोकल कॉर्ड्स वाइब्रेट विथ इच अदर द साउंड creates that is the simple concept now we have to come to the next point propagation of sound children sometimes what happens the far away distance also some sound is created but we are also able to hear it it is possible because of the propagation of sound through the medium as sound can travel in all directions and it has the ability to propagate so sound needs medium to propagate if we are in the school the bell rings and from every class every student can identify that bell rang why is it possible because that sound will be travel in all direction and it comes to us so if we can see the propagation of sound sound requires a medium for propagation in vacuum sound never propagates or you can say it can't travel now as we know as it requires the medium sound travels through solids liquids and air also generally the sound that we normally hear in our day to day life propagates through air only now we have to come to the point relative speed of sound in different media as we know sound travels through solids liquids and air solid travel more than four times faster through water and 15 times faster through solids than through air thank you